Ever wonder why people are leaving certain cities in America? It's a question that's been popping up more and more these days. The phenomenon we're talking about here is called the urban exodus. On the surface, it might seem strange. After all, aren't cities supposed to be brimming with opportunities, cultural hotspots, and the promise of a vibrant life? Well, the truth is, while cities do offer these things, they also come with their own set of challenges. High cost of living, competitive job markets, and concerns about quality of life are just a few of the factors causing people to seek greener pastures. Some are heading for smaller cities, others for the suburbs, and some are even opting for a rural life. The reasons are as varied as the people making the move, but they all have one thing in common. They're looking for a change, a shift, a fresh start. And so, the urban exodus continues. Today, we delve into some of these cities and uncover the specific reasons why their residents are packing up and moving out. First on our list, the Big Apple itself, New York City. New York City, a metropolis known for its towering skyscrapers, bustling streets, and vibrant culture, is a place like no other. Yet beneath its dazzling lights and ceaseless energy, the city has been grappling with a host of challenges. Known for its notoriously high cost of living, New York City is a tough nut to crack. From sky-high rents to costly groceries, living in this city can burn a hole in your pocket. It's not uncommon to find small apartments in Manhattan renting for thousands of dollars a month, and a simple dinner out can easily set you back $50. This high cost of living is compounded by the city's crowded conditions. With over 8 million residents packed into a relatively small area, New York City is one of the most densely populated cities in the United States. This leads to overcrowded subways, congested streets, and a lack of personal space, which can be overwhelming for many. Then came the pandemic, which hit New York City particularly hard. The city that never sleeps suddenly found itself in an unprecedented slumber. Businesses shuttered, streets emptied, and the city's vibrant energy was replaced with an eerie silence. The pandemic not only exposed the city's vulnerabilities but also made life in New York City more difficult. The pandemic also accelerated a trend that was already underway, New Yorkers leaving the city. With remote work becoming the new norm, many have been questioning the value of living in a high-cost, high-stress city. Some have chosen to relocate to quieter, more affordable areas, seeking a better quality of life and a break from the city's relentless pace. With all these factors at play, it's no surprise that many New Yorkers are choosing to relocate. Next, we head to the West Coast, to the City of Angels, Los Angeles. Los Angeles, often known for its glitz and glamour, is also home to some of the nation's most pressing urban challenges. Let's start with housing. The cost of living in LA is notoriously high, with housing being the main culprit. The median home value in Los Angeles has skyrocketed over the past decade, making it one of the most expensive cities in America to buy a home. This financial strain is not just for homeowners. Renters too are feeling the pinch with rental prices surging year after year. And then there's the infamous LA traffic. The city is known for its sprawling freeways that are often choked with cars, making commutes long and stressful. The city's car-centric culture coupled with its expansive geography means Angelinos spend a significant chunk of their day just getting from point A to point B. Lastly, let's not forget the state's frequent wildfires. These natural disasters have become a part of life for many Californians, including those living in Los Angeles. These fires not only pose a threat to life and property, but also contribute to poor air quality, making LA one of the most polluted cities in the country. These problems, high housing costs, crippling traffic, and rampant wildfires have made life in Los Angeles increasingly difficult. While the city certainly has its charms, these issues have started to overshadow the allure of the Hollywood sign and the sun-soaked beaches. The result? A growing number of Angelinos are packing up their surfboards and leaving the city. Some are heading to nearby states like Nevada and Arizona, where the cost of living is significantly lower. Others are going further afield, seeking a slower pace of life in the Midwest or the South. These challenges have led many Angelinos to seek greener pastures elsewhere. Moving on to the Lone Star State, we have Houston. This city, known for its space exploration, vibrant food scene, and a rich blend of cultures, has its own set of challenges. Houston's geographical location makes it prone to natural disasters, particularly flooding. The city's flat topography and clayey soil make it extremely susceptible to floodwaters. In recent years, Houston has seen some of the most devastating floods in its history, causing significant damage to property and tragically claiming lives. The city's vulnerability to flooding is a major concern for its residents. Next, let's talk about the heat. Houston's summers are not for the faint-hearted. 
The city's proximity to the Gulf of Mexico means that it experiences high humidity levels, which when combined with the soaring summer temperatures, can make the heat feel unbearable. This extreme heat can make everyday life uncomfortable and poses health risks, especially for the elderly and those with underlying health conditions. Lastly, we touch on Houston's economy. Houston, often referred to as the energy capital of the world, has an economy that's heavily reliant on the oil and gas industry. This dependence makes the city's economy vulnerable to fluctuations in oil prices. When oil prices drop, so does the city's economic health, leading to job losses and economic uncertainty. These factors, the risk of flooding, the intense heat, and the oil-dependent economy, have led some Houstonians to seek a change of scenery. Whether they're heading north to cooler climates or seeking out cities with more diversified economies, it's clear that the urban exodus has touched Houston as well. Next, we visit the city of brotherly love, Philadelphia. Known for its rich history, iconic cheesesteaks, and passionate sports fans, Philadelphia is a city that truly has a lot to offer. However, it's also a city grappling with its own set of challenges. Let's start with the poverty rate. Philadelphia has the highest poverty rate among the 10 largest cities in the United States, with more than a quarter of its residents living below the poverty line. This high poverty rate has far-reaching implications, affecting everything from housing to healthcare. Now, on to education. Philadelphia's public school system has been dealing with a multitude of issues, including budget cuts, overcrowded classrooms, and struggling schools. Many families are concerned about the quality of education that their children receive in these schools. Lastly, we look at crime. While Philadelphia is safer than many other large cities in the U.S., it does have a higher-than-average crime rate. This can make some parts of the city feel unsafe, particularly at night. These issues, the high poverty rate, the struggling school system, and the crime rate, have prompted some Philadelphians to relocate. Whether they're seeking better education opportunities for their children or simply hoping for a safer environment, it's clear that the urban exodus has also reached Philadelphia. As we continue our journey, we now head to the Sunshine State, to the vibrant city of Miami. Known for its stunning beaches, diverse culture, and bustling nightlife, Miami is a city that exudes energy and excitement. However, underneath the sun-kissed surface, Miami is also facing several challenges. Firstly, let's discuss the cost of living. Miami is one of the most expensive cities in the United States with housing costs that are well above the national average. The cost of renting or buying a home here can be prohibitive for many, making it difficult for families and individuals to make ends meet. Next, we turn to the issue of climate change. Miami is particularly vulnerable to the effects of climate change due to its coastal location. The city is regularly threatened by hurricanes and is facing an increasing risk of flooding due to rising sea levels. These environmental threats create a sense of uncertainty about the city's future and can be a significant factor in people's decision to move. Lastly, let's consider traffic. Miami's roads are notoriously congested, with residents facing long commute times that can add stress to their daily lives. The city's public transportation system is also often criticized for being unreliable, which exacerbates the problem. These challenges, high cost of living, climate change threats, and traffic congestion, have led many Miamians to consider moving. Whether they're seeking a more affordable lifestyle, a safer environment, or simply a more convenient commute, it's clear that Miami is also experiencing its own version of the urban exodus. As we continue this exploration of urban exodus, we find ourselves in the Pacific Northwest, in the Emerald City, Seattle. Known for its lush greenery, vibrant art scene, and iconic landmarks like the Space Needle, Seattle has much to offer. But beneath the city's charm, there are challenges that are causing some residents to reconsider calling it home. Firstly, let's talk about the weather. Seattle is infamous for its rainy climate. While some find the constant drizzle and overcast skies comforting, for others, it can lead to a sense of gloom and dampened spirits. The city sees an average of 152 rainy days per year, which can take a toll on the mood and overall well-being of its residents. Next, we address the high cost of living. Seattle is one of the most expensive cities in the United States, with housing costs soaring above the national average. The tech boom, spearheaded by companies like Amazon and Microsoft, has driven up property prices, making it challenging for many to afford a home in the city. This economic disparity is pushing many to seek more affordable living situations outside the city. Lastly, let's discuss traffic. Seattle, like many other major cities, suffers from congested roads and long commute times. 
The city's public transportation system, while reliable, struggles to keep up with the growing population. This congestion can add stress to daily life, making the prospect of a less crowded environment seem appealing. These factors, the gloomy weather, high cost of living and traffic congestion, are prompting some Seattleites to seek greener pastures. As we continue our journey, we'll see that Seattle is not alone in this urban exodus. We now turn our attention to the Windy City, Chicago. We now turn to the heartland of American automobile manufacturing, the Motor City, Detroit. Once a bustling metropolis, Detroit's decline in recent decades is a stark reminder of the city's struggle to adapt to a changing economy. The city's economic woes began with the decline of the auto industry, a sector that had once been the lifeblood of Detroit. As jobs moved overseas, the city's economy faltered, leading to a decline in population and a rise in unemployment. Today, Detroit is still grappling with the aftermath of these economic shifts, making it difficult for many residents to find stable, well-paying jobs. Moving on, let's discuss crime. Detroit has unfortunately earned a reputation for having one of the highest crime rates in the United States. While efforts are being made to address this issue, the perception of crime remains a significant deterrent for many considering making Detroit their home. The city's struggle with crime has exacerbated other issues, including housing and education. Speaking of education, Detroit's public school system faces its own set of challenges. Underfunding and a lack of resources have led to poor academic performance and high dropout rates. This has created a cycle of disadvantage that is difficult to break, pushing many families to seek better educational opportunities elsewhere. Given these issues, the struggling economy, high crime rate, and challenged education system, it's understandable why some Detroiters are choosing to relocate. As we continue our journey, we'll see how these factors play out in other cities across the nation. Next, we travel to the Windy City, Chicago. Finally, we head to the East Coast, to the historic city of Boston. Known for its rich history, prestigious universities, and passionate sports fans, Boston offers a unique blend of old-world charm and modern sophistication. However, like many other cities, it is not without its challenges. Our first stop in Boston is the cost of living. With housing prices that are among the highest in the nation, Boston can be a difficult place to put down roots. The high cost of living extends beyond just housing, affecting everything from groceries to healthcare. This financial strain can be a significant deterrent for individuals and families considering making Boston their home. Next, we turn to the weather. Boston's climate is characterized by harsh winters and hot, humid summers. The city is no stranger to heavy snowfall, with winter storms often bringing the city to a standstill. In the summer, Bostonians must contend with high temperatures and humidity, creating uncomfortable living conditions. Lastly, we have to mention the city's notorious traffic. Boston's roads are often congested, leading to long commute times for many residents. This daily frustration, coupled with the city's high cost of living and challenging weather, can make life in Boston stressful. These challenges, while significant, are balanced by the city's many charms. However, they have led many Bostonians to consider relocating. As we continue our journey, we'll see how these factors play out in other cities across the nation. Next, we travel back to the Midwest to the Windy City, Chicago. Our third city is the Windy City, Chicago. Known for its towering skyscrapers, deep dish pizza, and vibrant blues music, Chicago is a city with a rich history and culture. However, it's also a city facing its fair share of challenges. First among these challenges is the issue of high taxes. Chicago is known to have some of the highest property taxes in the nation. This financial burden can be a heavy weight to bear, especially for families and individuals striving to make ends meet. The city's sales tax isn't much better, clocking in at a staggering 10 and a quarter percent. This makes it one of the highest sales taxes in the United States. When you couple these high taxes with the harsh winters that Chicagoans have to endure, it's easy to see why some people might be considering a move. The Windy City lives up to its name, especially in the winter months. Temperatures often drop below freezing and the city's location on the shores of Lake Michigan means it's frequently hit with heavy snowfall and biting winds. These harsh winters can make everyday life a struggle and can take a toll on the city's infrastructure. Another concern that's often raised when discussing Chicago is the city's crime rate. While it's worth noting that crime rates vary from neighborhood to neighborhood, and that many areas of the city are very safe, there are certain parts of Chicago that have unfortunately earned a reputation for high levels of crime. This perception of crime, whether fully accurate or not, can deter people from wanting to make Chicago their home. Given these issues, 
it's understandable why some Chicagoans are choosing to move. Last, but certainly not least, we turn to the tech hub of America, San Francisco. Known for its iconic Golden Gate Bridge, vibrant cultural scene, and of course its central role in the tech industry, this city has a lot to offer. But beneath the surface, there are some significant challenges that are pushing residents to reconsider calling San Francisco their home. The most glaring issue is the astronomical cost of housing. San Francisco has one of the highest median home prices in the nation, making it nearly impossible for the average person to afford a home within city limits. This has led to an influx of people moving to the outskirts of the city or leaving the Bay Area altogether. Then, there's the issue of homelessness. Despite its reputation as a wealthy city, San Francisco has one of the highest rates of homelessness in the United States. The city's officials are grappling with this issue, but with rising housing costs and a lack of affordable solutions, it's a problem that continues to grow. The dynamics of the tech industry are also changing. For years, San Francisco has been the epicenter of tech innovation, but with the rise of remote work, many tech workers are realizing they can do their jobs from anywhere. This has led to a tech exodus, with some companies even offering incentives for employees to relocate to less expensive areas. Moreover, the city's charm that once attracted millions is now being overshadowed by its challenges. From the congestion and noise, to the high cost of living and social inequality, these factors are making many residents rethink their decision to stay. San Francisco, once a dream destination for many, is now facing a harsh reality. The city is at a crossroads, grappling with issues that threaten its very identity. And while there's no easy solution, the city's resilience and innovative spirit give hope for a brighter future. With these challenges, it's clear why many San Franciscans are opting to leave. From the East Coast to the West, it's clear that many American cities are experiencing an exodus. It's a pattern that's been emerging across the board, a shift in the tides of urban living. In New York City, the high cost of living and quality of life concerns have become too much for many. Los Angeles, too, is losing residents, with the changing job market and increasing cost of housing driving people out. Chicago, once a bustling hub of activity, is facing a similar fate. The city's high crime rates and declining job opportunities have seen a steady stream of people packing their bags. And let's not forget San Francisco, where skyrocketing housing prices and the changing face of the tech industry have forced many to reconsider their options. These aren't just random moves, they're symptomatic of larger trends and shifts in our society. As we navigate the changing landscape of American cities, one thing is certain, the face of urban America is evolving. That's it for our tour of the top cities people are leaving in America. We hope this information has been enlightening for you. If you found this video informative, please give it a thumbs up. Your support helps us continue to bring you content like this. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more videos exploring the changing face of our cities and the patterns influencing these shifts. We'd love to hear your thoughts and experiences on this urban exodus. Leave a comment below and join the conversation. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.